dun 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 Hi! Welcome back to Stray, where we're going to die because we lost our UV ray ultra power seismic boom make things pop power. Uh... Oh no, now all we got is basic flashlight. Basic flashlight, basic flashlight, basic flat. Kitty can fit through there. Momo! Is that Momo? That is not Momo. <laughs> Baladin, a traveler for the sewers. We haven't seen one of you in ages. Are you the one who contacted us earlier? A little outsider? Zabaltz are an outsider has been expecting you. He's meditating on the top of our village. Oh, God. No, not a monk. Ant village. This machine, the scientist I assisted, used one of these. What was she? He was sick. In his last hope, he walked into the machine, but I wasn't with him. He was alone. What was he doing? Oh, that thing's a cryogenic chamber. Anyway, he uploaded himself into the computer, and then everything was different. But the upload, something went wrong. He was stuck for hundreds of years, until a little cat appeared. Was it... It was... Me. I was the scientist. I was human. I I need a moment. Whoa, that was a plot twist. I thought that was a cryogenic chamber. Never mind then. Howdy, stranger. I'm sorry, I I need a moment. I don't feel like talking right now. Oh, you're no fun. Oh, that's awesome. They have TV. Holy crap. <gasps> Kitty power. Destroy everything. Destroy the rug. Uh, destroy the rug. This rug has fringe. Anyway. I wonder where this one was made. It's an oriental rug with fringe. Uh, I said Q. I'm hitting everything but Q. <gasps> Clawing the furniture. I have to mark my territory and destroy everything. Oh, you have a camera head! Interesting, I haven't seen a camera head robot before. Sweet. How far can we get it to swing? Oh, whatever. Oh, he won't even light up his light. Dang. He must really be in the deck. Dum dum dee 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 dum dum. Oh, now you're ready to talk. What else have I forgotten? I must have had parents, friends. What happened to everyone? I wanted to open the city, but is there even anyone left to save? Probably not. Then again, anything is possible in this little world. <gasps> oh my god, he is a monk. What is this? 
Oh god, he uploaded himself to everything. Hey, don't you know not to interrupt a fellow during his transcend <laughs> his transcendental meditation? Oh, it's you. You were with Momo when we received our call earlier. I'm glad to meet you at last, little outsider. You know Momo and Doc, so you're already familiar with us outsiders. I miss them. Their memory brings me peace. Momo stayed in the slums. I heard you help find Doc. And Clementine? She's in Midtown now. If you still want to see the outside, she's the one who can get you there. Apparently she had some kind of plan to leave the city. Here, take this. I wrote her address on the back of this picture. Chunky Clementine. <laughs> when she stepped on that bridge, that old bridge trembled, then disassembled. <laughs> if now you know that song, I would suggest looking up Chunky Clementine. <laughs> Midtown, climb up our little village. It should be easy for you, Dexterous Little One. If you manage to reach the outside, you will be the very first. I'd wish you good luck, but you don't need it. I believe in you. Awesome, now look at the stars. I'm sorry for shutting down earlier. I'm a human, probably the last in the world. Now look what this left me. So much has come back to me. How much have I forgotten? Everything. Maybe if we find Clementine, we can restore my memories and get you back home at the same time. We can go back down and find out more from the companions or head onward to Midtown. The companions? From Yorvesco? <laughs> oh my god, he's a video projector! Call me this tin chef. I specialize in upcycling leftovers. Today's special ramen J45 with my secret ingredient. Hi. This food is actually horrible, but it's the only thing around. I'll have to unscrew my front casing if I keep eating this trash. That's sad. That's mean. Hey, stop scratching that. Never. Wait, wait, wait. I want to talk to everybody. Though we have no purpose here, apparently. Which chapter are we on? The soothing sound of trash falling, shimmering waterfalls. No dangers. Trash falling! I don't see no trash. Simmering waterfalls. This blissful place to work on my poetry. Here, listen. The, my, I ain't listening to that. Wake up, pansy! Electric zerk everywhere. That sounds scary. If they gain the power of electricity, we're doomed. Yeah, this, for some reason, this kind of gives me bubblegum KK vibes. Haha. <laughs> If anybody knows what I'm talking about, leave a comment. Hey, I got an achievement! Oops. Uh, <laughs> sorry! 
<laughs> I feel like such a jerk now. I didn't realize they were playing a game. What the hell game is that? Did you know there are more than 900 shades of white paint? Don't tell anyone, but I'm creating my own shade of paint. I'm calling it Garbage Brown. Well then... I'm such a jerk. The way they put their head on, like, oh no. What are they playing? I don't know that game. It looks like dominoes, but thicker. <laughs> hey, you! Mary's in her deconstruct. Activist period, so she says, I'm sure she'll become a great artist. If only she could practice elsewhere. I do love the smell of fresh paint. I like the taste of fresh paint. Wait, what? I do love the smell of fresh paint. It reminds me of. Oh, wait. I can't smell anything. How sad. That's, that's really sad. Ha! Ah, I'm ruining your artwork. Where are we going? Oh, yes! I disposed of your paint. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? You can get up here. What's that do? Do we give it to the paint lady? Probably a robot who would love them. Yeah, who? Ooh, you. Hello there. It has been so long since we've had a visitor. Well, except those damn zerks, of course. Imagine if we could harness their power, having them run in a wheel or something. Such wasted potential. Hamster wheel! I like it. Enslave the Zerks. When I grow up, I want to be great like Aunt Clementine. I want to explore like she did, but the grown-ups forbade us to leave Ant Village. You're a kid. You're big, though. Damn. <laughs> I'm not going to say anything. Clementine was the only one who liked my poetry. I miss her. The soothing sound. The mighty concrete shielding me it's in its womb. Shall you also be my tomb? I never said I didn't like your poetry. I just don't want to listen to it. <laughs> Where do I go now? Remember. This language, the companion robots made it up from scratch. How impressive. I remember it happening when I was in the network. I don't know when exactly, but at one time all communication started to switch to these symbols. I was stuck in a computer and alone for a long time, so I translated every symbol and word one by one until I was able to understand everything. Now that I'm out and I know their language, I'm curious to hear all they have to say. Okay.
9,536 games, 1 to 6. Don't tell anybody, I'm actually programmed to win at this game. <laughs> hmm, statistically, I should have won at least 8 times. Or should I wreck their game again? I won't. Oh, it teleported back into her inventory. No wonder why she keeps losing. Uh oh. Somebody called this drunk. Me, I. Call <laughs> no! He's quoting the exact words from Skyrim! Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. No! No! Not, not Skyrim in Stray! No, how could you do such a thing? I was a bellbot many cycles ago. But I've repurposed myself into Treasure Hunter. Don't be fooled by the sound of it. It can be hurt, hard and gruesome, just like this arm I found. My poor fellow, may he rest in peace. Oh god, you did find an arm. You should find Clementine. Climb to the top of our village. Ah, and find the path to reach Midtown. Okay. Time to go up. I've talked to everybody there is to talk to, I think. Yes, there's people up high. There is people up higher. Anybody want any flout? Oh, buddy, did you know that Aunt Clementine taught us how to grow special plants that can live without sunlight? I have a huge collection of them. Do you want to see? It's still missing some colors, though. It's missing a yellow plant, a red one, and yeah. Ah, uh, purple plant. Okay, now I can't leave. Is the yellow one up higher? Hi. I'm bored. Aunt Clementine was used to old classes here. We learned a lot of cool stuff. Yes. Oh my god. Give me the paint. Yes. Now let's go down here and mix paints. Uh, where's the yellow plant at? We will find the yellow plant. And then we'll leave this place. Oh! Now, how do I get over there? There we go. There we go. Oh, I heard it's a rare plant. Thank you. Could you find the other for me? Please, please. Oh, wow. It looks so pretty. Thank you. Could you find the other one for me? Please, please. I love that color. Thanks, buddy. You found them all. Thank you so much. Here is a reward. Take my badge. Ooh, plant badge. It looks good with it. 
It looks so good with it. Well, take care now. See ya, friend. Yes, now I can move on and be satisfied with my life. How do we go up higher? Yeah, there we go. Why is there an AC unit right there? Why does that look like a bomb just strapped right there? <laughs> think that's gonna be it we explored the village we annoyed the person who was meditating then he realized we're not annoying after all and then we clawed everybody's stuff we uh dumped pink cans and yeah we found the skyrim reference uh some may call this junk me i call them treasures and yeah that's about it we did everything in the village. We handed out the flowers. We got cute little flower pads. <laughs> okay, well, I'll see you all crazy, crazy people in the next video. If you feel like joining, bye.